All right, guys, I'm gonna make this video really, really quickly. So we have these reels here and they were really clunky and you had to kind of almost unroll the entire situation to um, to kind of separate both ends of the SDI cable. And so uh, I kind of did some digging and some searching and I came up with this idea that I think is really going to um, make the situation a whole lot easier and better for us. So basically we have the reel here. And what I did was I drilled a hole um, right in the wheel itself so that basically the cable that goes into the battle box by the computer, <clears throat> you've got about, you know, three or four feet of that, excuse the junk in the background, <laughs> but that goes into our computer side. And then, so that way we can just reel everything else up, um, from the TV that, for the, that needs to go to the TV side back to the computer. So basically what it does, is it, when it's finished, it looks just like this. <clears throat> Where we have this side, it's gonna go to the computer, right? And it's already kind of set, ready to go. It's not moving anywhere. And then we can just take this side right here and then just unravel it and go where we have to go for the, um, the TV side. I would suggest connecting the TV first and then kind of um, running the cable back to the computer and just sitting it down and then we unravel this and then plug it right on into the battle box and we're good to go. And then once we're finished, obviously we just do the reverse. We <clears throat> un unplug the cable, the battle box, wrap this up, um, unplug the TV side, and then we should be able just to reel it back in with relative ease, guys. So I hope this is going to help all of us in our, in our, and helping to make the setup more efficient and easy. Appreciate you guys.